Hey everyone, Nicole Young here, and in today's video, I'm gonna share with you a very quick tip on how to customize the workspace inside of Lightroom Classic CC. Now I'm in the develop module, and over on the right, we have all of our editing panels. If you're a Lightroom user, then you are probably already very familiar with all of these panels. Now, it's quite possible that there are panels here that maybe you just don't use very often. For me, one of those panels is the calibration panel. I really only tend to go here if I'm working on an older photo that has not been updated yet to the most current version of Lightroom. And even then, if I forget to change this, it doesn't always affect my photo. And sometimes if I apply a preset, it's automatically going to switch that version over for me. I also tend to not really use the lens correction panel that often. Whatever it is for you, sometimes these panels can just tend to clutter up the workspace. So if you'd like to clean things up a little bit over on the right there, this tip is perfect for you. This is also great if you want to customize the order of those panels. So to get to this customization setting, hover over the name of any of these panels, right click, and select Customize Develop Panel. A new window is going to pop up and it's going to let you toggle the visibility of these panels and also change their order. So for me, I'm gonna go ahead and uncheck that lens correction along with the calibration and I'm also going to reorder a few of these panels. So let's say I like to use the split toning panel and the effects panel. So maybe I start out with basic edits and then I jump to split toning and then I jump to effects. It's going to be a little bit easier to have those three panels grouped together. So I have everything set here. I'll go ahead and click save. Now, because I'm making some changes to the order of those panels, I'm going to need to relaunch the program, so I'll go ahead and click on that relaunch button. Okay, Lightroom has opened back up, and now you can see over on the right, I start out with that basic panel. Right below it is split toning, and then effects. And if you keep looking, the calibration and the lens correction panels are now gone. Now, if you want to get those back, it's really simple. Just right click over the title of one of those panel and select show all. And there's that lens correction and the calibration panel. Now, if you want to reset everything back to normal, go back into that customized develop panel settings and select default order. Click save, relaunch Lightroom, and when Lightroom comes back up, I'll have everything back as it was.